trucking is uh, one of the hardest jobs besides sitting in a truck with a barking dog. <laughs> and uh, uh, what are you barking at, buddy? Hmm? You barking at the UPS man? Well, anyway, you have to be, uh, you don't have to be a certain type of guy or person to uh, be a truck driver. You, you just have to be willing to be a truck driver. And uh, there's all types of training and everything. Some companies will want to train you in their trucks and with a, another driver for three weeks, two weeks, three weeks. And then there's schools you can go to for about three weeks every day. And uh, that cost. And uh, the uh, training with another driver is usually, it costs two, but you don't have to pay money, but you have to guarantee them a year uh, of driving. And so if you don't like it, well, if you quit, then you owe them for the rest. So if you go a week, then you owe them for for uh, what 50 one more weeks so you don't want to do that and then there's uh, companies that pay you and uh, put you with a driver and uh, they're pretty nice drivers they get you out there and they train you like like I got trained uh, it was it was good I was there six weeks with this one driver and we were cross-country and uh, so there's all, all types of training. And then you have to have the mindset that, uh, I don't know, uh, I've never done this before, but uh, you get to talking to other drivers and you find out that, that they've done this for a long time. And then I've had to go through the problem of, uh, I, I was late. Uh, my first time I was late and I couldn't, I was going to New Jersey. I was uh, scared of the traffic and everything, a big, big truck. And uh, up there in New Jersey where things are tight and there's a lot of traffic and cars running everywhere. And uh, I was running late and I figured that myself, hey, knock it off. Can you see I'm recording here? Uh, I was running late and I had to tell myself that I'm probably not the first one that's been late. Other drivers, other companies, all that stuff have been late. And sure enough, I got there, I was a little late, but they took me and loaded me anyway. Uh, some companies, uh, depends, you know, because uh, some companies, they may make you wait till the next day. And it depends on the company you're delivering to also. Uh, I know some of them are pretty tough and tight with their time schedules. And if you don't get there on time, you got to reschedule. Well, what are you going to do? Uh, if you're with a good company, they'll send you somewhere to drop that trailer and they'll have somebody else deliver it and then you pick up an empty and go somewhere else and pick up a load. And uh, other companies, uh, uh, especially uh, owner operators, they may have to sit there for a day or two and get rescheduled for a couple of days later or who knows a week later or something and then the owner operators are there's something somebody to talk to they're interesting and then uh, company drivers like i was i really enjoyed being a company driver uh, i had insurance I had dental i had a new truck after I got seniority, after about, I don't know, a year or two, three, uh, I got a brand new truck. And uh, every year I got a brand new truck <laughs> after that because my company was always buying new trucks. And their trucks weren't over three years old, maybe four. You know, I talked to one driver, he'd been in his truck for, for years because he didn't want to give it up. And uh, he liked it and he was moved in. So that's okay. They let him...
of what I was doing. Of course, I was conscious of what I was doing all the time because you're in a great big truck. I mean, it's 53 feet long, 71 and a half feet, 71 feet, one inch long. And uh, it's just a big thing to be driving on the road. Of course, I admire these other truckers that carry real heavy equipment and everything. Their, their load is even heavier and bigger. And uh, sometimes they're so big they take up a couple of lanes and uh, they got the police following them so nobody will run into them. And uh, the, anyway, that's a different story in itself. I never did that. But uh, I admire those truck drivers. We got really got the mine of steel. <laughs> so I'll see you next time. God bless you and have a good day.